I pull up my gel on my shoes, yeah. Bitch, if you step on them, ooh, I get to the fracking with you, my shooters are here from the roof, yeah. What's up, guys? It's Kato, and today my babyless pros die. They just don't charge anymore. They hold the charge for like five minutes and then they die every single time I do a cut. And that's the babyless pros. I've had them for like 10 months, but I have not been using them that much. I've done like under 50 cuts with this and it's it's done for it. so that's my review on the baby list pro clipper for effects not really a good clipper i'm sorry baby list i roll a baby list but that clipper no good this trimmer right here also a baby list trimmer i don't know what happened but every time i use this it cuts people's necks so this trimmer also not a good trimmer maybe their other tools are better but these baby list tools that i have right here are not the best they, they worked decent for the time that i had them and then basically as you heard that's what's going on with them so today we went out and bought us some wall clippers and the wall paint this is the wall designer so we got new clippers today because we all know how reliable wall is they got a one-year warranty my baby list pros also have a two-year warranty but it's out of the city for me, so I'm definitely not gonna go to Woodbridge, Ontario to return them. I don't know what the price is on those. I'm thinking there's something under $100, because I don't know. I don't think anything over $100 would do that. I'm not 100%, I don't know if it's just mine, but I don't think so. Let's just open this. This is the All-Star Combo, standard designer, small size peanut. It's pretty much great what it says on the box. It doesn't say much else. I'm hoping I got a 0.5 guard in here and a 1.5 because, like I said, those would bring you to such a great advantage. You would have such an advantage if you had the 0.5 and the 1.5. So we're going to try and crack this open. Oh. You guys might want to grab scissors because that was a little crazy of an unboxing. So well, let's get right to it. This looks so clean. Like right away I'm taking this out. Like just looking at this compared to this. Feels like a better design. It feels like a way cleaner tool. It just seems like there's a lot more money put in this tool. I'm again not trying to hate on Babyless because I still use their, their color bowl and their uh, blow dryer. Though I haven't tried any other tools. I got a lot of Babyless stuff with my original kit from school. And that's the tools I've been working with. The only tools I've been working with other than old Walmart clone airs back when I was a kid. So, so far from my experience, I don't know, I'm not really liking this. That's just my personal experience. Let me know what you guys think. This wall peanut, I've heard so many stories about these wall peanuts. And I wanna turn this on, I just wanna test it out. Cause like, the sound is so aggressive on my baby list. Like it's it's a, a roaring engine. It feels so good in my hand. Let's take this little case off. Like just look at that. Just look at that, it looks beautiful. Like it looks like such a well-designed item. That's like, it's so nice. Let's move on to these little guards that they came with. Like I got two little guards, I think, with the uh, baby list for the trimmer. So that's what you get there with the baby list for your trimmer. I've never used these. I'm not sure the size. It says three eighths. So I don't know. Here we got half inch this is actually nice because these are pretty long these are pretty long guards now for a trimmer i guess further down the line i'm going to be using those i'm assuming considering they come with a kit they must be useful let's check out this designer i went to sally's beauty store today and i was not going there with the intentions of buying a wall clipper at all i went there just to buy a better clipper than that one because it broke so i was just looking for a uh, good bank for my buck. I got this one for $135 and then I paid for the year warranty. It was extra 15 bucks. Uh, I figured with what happened with the battery on that one, I want a warranty. So we got the warranty back. But anyways, this wall clipper, like all of my whole lifetime watching videos on YouTube of people doing like wall fades and all these nice fades. And so I've seen these put to work. Let's open this up. Why is the blade? Can y'all see that? That is the most crooked blade I've ever laid eyes on. I'm gonna have to Google this because this blade looks extremely crooked. I don't know what I'm looking at right now. That blade's really crooked. I've never seen that. Look how straight that blade is. That blade is right there. It's straight. 
I'm really confused. So I just went ahead and looked up what was going on with the blade. And it turns out the blade was just crooked and I had to actually adjust it with these screws on the back here. I looked up a little wall video on Facebook. So shout out to wall to having the answers to their own problems. But the blade wasn't supposed to be like that. Just adjust your blade if it's crooked. You don't got to return it. We're all good still with the wall designer and wall peanut all-star combo. Honestly, this design, like look at this. It's it's got like this nice texture to it. It's got a really cool like texture finish on the outside. This is crazy. It's a little bit it's a little bit heavier. It's a lot heavier actually. But I feel like this is gonna do me more justice. It just looks like a better tool. It's like that power. Like I feel the power in that. It's strong. It's a strong tool. I think this is gonna cut through thick hair really easy. Like listen to this. Do you hear that sound? It's like, and like that's what it sounds like to me. This one's like, like it's said from the heavens. Like, Let's put these to the sound test. Wall peanut and the babyless trimmer. Like these tools just sound like rough. Crack open these guards. Two, three, four, five, six. Oh, it's only a six piece. This is weird. It didn't come with a 0.5 or a 1.5 like I thought. And it didn't come with a, a five or a seven. For some reason, it skips from four to six and six to eight. I'm extremely confused right now as to why that's a thing. Maybe it's just like not common. I don't know. Because I don't really use those numbers to be honest, but I need those. 0.5 and uh, 1.5 so I'm definitely gonna have to go on Amazon and buy those and hit you guys back with that because we, th we thought they were gonna come in the kit and they didn't but these look really nice honestly like these guards even compared to these guards like let's pick up a big one what's this the 8 yeah look at this this is an 8 and this is an 8 look at the design like just the, it's, a, it's a nicer design this looks a little dusty Every time I clean these for some reason, like, I feel like I'm getting all the hair out, but there's like weird debris. And, like, I, I think it's hair. Like, I'm not even sure what's going on. I'm hoping these ones give me a better cleaning job. They got cool little round tips on the top. So I don't know what that's gonna do. But I'm gonna hit you guys back after I do one little test out with these and see how these work for me. I'm gonna check out this blade. Hopefully everything's all good. And I'll hit you guys back after I do a haircut with these. Maybe show you guys a little example of how it works out. And that's it for the all-star combo. The wall peanut and the wall design. I'm going to hit you guys back. I'll see you guys until next time. It's Kato and I'm out. Get what you sippin', huh? Huh? Post up out front, out front. See all my goons in the yard. In the cut. What you want? want? You ain't want no from my squad. No, no. Double, double, double up. Be what you got in your cup, huh? Load that, load that. Yeah.